Just do what? Lob me. Lob you out? Okay, yeah. I don't see anything crazy. Hi guys, welcome to today's video. I'm super excited. So as soon as I got engaged, I instantly started buying a bunch of white dresses and outfits and started planning out what I was going to wear to every event. So I think I pretty much have everything covered. <laughs> I don't exactly know what I'll wear to each event, but I do have a couple different casual dresses and some fancier ones for some of our bigger events leading up to the wedding. So I figured I would do a little try on and show you what I have for now and what I plan on wearing it with. And I will link everything that I can, that I can find. <laughs> Cause all the stuff I already had before and yeah, that way you guys, if you have a future wedding or even just want to find a couple of these white pieces because they can look good whenever and I can still wear them even after I'm married. So here we go. So this first one here, you'll be able to see everything better in the try on version of the video, but the back is super cute. On Amazon, I did not pronounce the brand and I'm not going to try and butcher it. So, like I said, I'll link everything below. This is the first one. Super cute. I figured it could be a good, like, a trying on wedding dress. Dress to wear. Could be good for, like, a bridal party brunch. Something like that. So, and that kind of goes for the next one too, also from Amazon. There's that one. I really like the like back, how it swoops and has the bow in the back and these poofy sleeves. So another very comfortable uh, flowy dress that could be used for any of those things too. I had. I'm trying to remember where I got this because I did have this before. It is Wild Fable, so I'm not going to help people find it and maybe me find it. Um, but I had this one before. I wore it to some pictures that kind of got done at a sunflower field last spring. I really like it. It's a really good like beach dress or just like a throw on dress. It's pretty casual. Super cute, really comfortable. Right, and then this next one I have is from Windsor. And a couple of the items are from that. So this dress I actually got before I was engaged. And I was going to wear it for a work event that we had, like an awards dinner. But then I kind of decided against it because it's a short dress and it is kind of tight and maybe a little too fancy for the event that I had. So I have not worn it yet. I still have the tag on it. But I figured this would be a really good one maybe for like the rehearsal dinner. Um, I kind of thought about for the engagement party, but it is kind of warm like the sleeves and the material is kind of thick. So I don't think I'd be very comfortable wearing it there. And it is a little, maybe a little too fancy for that too. So probably rehearsal dinner. We'll see. Okay. This next one is my absolute favorite out of all the dresses that I have in this video. It's right here. So this one is from Revolve. Poofy sleeves on it. The neckline is really nice, you can see on the try-on. So I've been wanting to get something from Revolve for a while. I just haven't had any events that I need to spend that much money on a dress for. And so when I was looking for like engagement, pictures, dresses and whatnot, I came across this one and it I usually wear either a medium or a large and both those sizes were sold out 
So I did send in like my email and the link and then they got it, sent me an email when it came back in stock. <clears throat> so the medium came back in stock first and I was not gonna wait for the large because I felt like it looked a little on the tighter side. So I kind of wanted to go bigger. That way it was comfortable. So I was like, whatever, I'm doing it. I really like this dress, it's super cute. So I ordered the medium and then it came in and I went to go try it on and I couldn't even, I couldn't put it over my head. I couldn't pull it up over my butt. I just could not get it on and I was scared of tearing it. So I was just gonna return it. But I did order it like last month maybe. I was like, well, I'm going to the gym, eat better. Maybe I'll be able to fit it, you know? And then today when I was doing this video, I was like, oh, I'll go ahead and try it again. If I can't fit it today, I'll definitely need to go back on see if I can run the large that's back in stock now. And then I realized when I went to try it on the last time, I did not put the zipper down all the way. So the zipper in the back goes all the way down here. So there's only a little bit that's not zipper, most of it's zipper. And I was probably, it got stuck maybe like right here at first and that's how long I thought it went. Um, so it did in fact fit. Now that I put the zipper all the way down, I had to have Kevin help me zip it back up, but super cute. It's my favorite dress I've probably ever owned, especially like a short dress. So I'm super excited to wear that. And then this next one is another Windsor one. So this one's pretty fun. I was thinking it's really good for a bachelorette party. With a little lace in the bottom throughout the whole dress. The middle of it that's see through but still lace. The top of it is super cute. So I really like this one too. Super cute, super fun. Um, definitely a little more on the risque side, so I'm not gonna wear it just any event, but Bethlehem, I feel like. This would be perfect for. Alright, and then this next one wasn't completely white. It does have some flowers in it. It's like an off white with flowers. But I am planning on wearing this for our engagement pictures, so I wanted to include it in the video. This one is what was it from Dry Goods? Yep, yeah, it's from Dry Goods. So love the neckline in this one too. It's very similar to the other one. Should probably not wear two dresses that are pretty much the same, but they make me happy and I really like them and they're really pretty. So and this one has a little more flow to it. And it's a little bit longer. So I think you can get some different pictures for it. But yeah, super excited to wear this one too. This would be another good one for like a brunch or a shopping day or something cute like that. And finally, I have this jumpsuit. So I guess I shouldn't say this is all dresses because I do have a jumpsuit. And I had this jumpsuit from Windsor. I got this the same time I went and got that bachelorette dress. I just went and tried white dresses and this is the stuff I found. So love the pants on it. The bottoms are very like wide and flowy. You're gonna be super cute with some heels. Uh, I love the back of it and the bow on it. Um, I do feel like this is the last time I just tried it on, but it does seem like a little more see-through than I thought. So I'll definitely have to plan undergarments with that. Um, but I am planning on wearing this for my engagement party. So as I'm filming this, it's before my engagement party. So we'll see if that is what I actually end up doing. Um, especially now that I've tried out some of these other dresses, I'm starting to wonder if I want to switch it out. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe, especially if you want to be notified whenever I post more of these wedding related videos and you get to see where I end up wearing these dresses to and how I end up styling them. So I just wore the same shoes and all the try-ons because I didn't want to go up and down the stairs and 
fun shoes for every outfit and everything. So super excited to pick out jewelry and accessories, purses. Um, I'm thinking even for like getting pictures, maybe a hat or something cutesy like that. So yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.